your experience with, with Raul. Um, any stories you have, just anything in general. If no one's forced to, I open up the floor, and I'm gonna begin with Justin. <laughs> <laughs> On behalf of sales, Rahul, um, you know, when I think of Rahul, I think that he's got it. You know, he always nails it. So whenever there's a site, whenever there's a, there's a client, and whenever we need something in food and beverage, Rahul's got it. And that's really his response on email, I got it. Is this gonna be set? Sometimes I'm a little bit last minute. I'm like, is this, is this all set? And his response is always, got it. So um, his positive attitude, great smile, and on behalf of sales, thanks for helping us close all the business that we did. Um, we're gonna miss you, buddy, but congratulations. Thank you very much for everything you did. Well, um, you've been uh, fantastic to me. Uh, just trying to get, getting me acclimated, uh, getting me on my feet, uh, and your support, sure. I appreciate it. Um, you obviously know where you're going and what you're getting into. This is my <laughs> cohort, Jason. Where are you? Um, spent, spent many, many days at the Sheraton, uh, but you know, I think that you're going to do very well at it, so I wish you very well. All right, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. He talked to his instrument side up. He's actually been a pleasure to work for. He's been very patient with engineering. Uh, I mean, hate to see it go, but like Kyle Brown says, you're right down the street. You know the school is. You're your father, you're laid back, you're So uh, I just I can't thank you for your, your patience with me and uh, the day's work. To see you soon. I want to thank you on behalf of all the union workers and regular workers. I think that uh, if you guys know Raul, we know him pretty well, work very close with him. And I think that we can forget what people say to us, but we never forget what, how people make us feel. And Raul made a lot of people feel that they were human, they were equal to him, and that's a very nice quality to have in a manager that not everybody has. So, I never become friends with any manager here, so I mean, like, years and I became friends with Raul, a very interesting, we always crash in many things, but at the end of the day, we came out to be in the middle ground, and it was very nice to work with this young lady. <laughs> 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 we know that he's going to be Numerous times with groups, um, whether it be Riverfront that have gone to HANA or my, most recently the group that the 100 person group that was flipped easily flawless um, and it would have been done without you, that's for sure. Um, so you're going to be missed. Thank you so much for everything you've done. That's okay. 30 seconds. <laughs> All I can say, I know everybody say it said it's living, it's not living, it's not going nowhere, is right down the street. And the thing is, once we get another excitement, if there is another 3,000 people like a New Year's Eve, as everybody know, we have a couple thousand. So probably is going to be over here and help us out. <laughs> so, just, just so you know, it, it's down the street, it's not going anywhere. All I can say, good luck. All right? And we'll see you wow. over here. Good job.
involved with our clients, and um, you know, you were always very welcoming when, whenever we had special guests in Hana and everything. Um, what, in particular, you know, the welcome that you gave our guests when they weren't even with myself. You know, like the ABA guests that were coming in on their own, and how you always remembered them and what they drink and all that good stuff. So I really, really do appreciate you. Um, I'm just glad you're going to the Sheridan and not somewhere else. So thank you and good luck.
that's where you were. I thought you were that way. I don't want to know where you were. <laughs> One thing that I remember about you, or I'll always remember, is that you have so many nicknames for people. And I was just trying to learn everybody's real names, and then he had a nickname, and I'm like, how am I going to match all of this? And, but then I didn't even get to work with you long enough to get my own nickname. <laughs> but good luck to you, and we hope you well this year. Wow, that's cool. Well, let's first do one thing. Um, I don't know if you mentioned it, but Raul's a new father. Raul was a new father. I think everyone knows that. Liam, his son, was born what? September. Okay, so, <laughs> so one, uh, about six weeks ago. Six weeks ago now. So let's um, raise our glasses or water, or whatever, and congratulate him on being a father. It's a great experience. Sure. Yeah. 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 And when I think of Raul, um, I wrote down a few things. Um, Two words come to mind, and those two words are commitment and caring. Um, first of all, commitment, first one real easy. He commutes and is so committed to this property, everyone knows where he lives, right? Who doesn't know where Raul lives? 90 miles west. 90 miles <laughs> west in Rockford, in Rockford, and commutes here and does it because it assists his wife. So he really sacrifices a lot already for his family and commutes here. He never says a word about it. He never complains about it. I ask him about it and he still doesn't complain about it. So his commitment to the hotel as relates to just his commute and his commitment to his family is outstanding. Karen, our lowest star voice scores in the hotel before Raul got here were in Anna and Emily, in room dining, and the cooks, etc., in these three areas was extremely low. And one of his first commitments was, I'm gonna get those Star Wars scores up. And you don't do that by accident. You do it by what everyone else is talking about here. His commitment, his caring, his nicknames, his knowing you as an individual before expecting something for you in a job. He gets to know you. The Star Wars scores went from 71% engagement to a 92% engagement for his areas. Supervisor effectiveness went from 52 to 89. I've never seen scores like that go up as dramatically as they have with, with Raul up the helm. So I think that in itself just deserves a round of applause. <laughs> This is like the most touching farewell ever, right? And it's, I guess it's scary because all of you all have a very short time and anyway, way I guess impact in my life and my wife's life. You guys are like family. Uh, everyone over here has a nickname and it's funny. All the nicknames are very funny. Some of them are just Chicken Caesar and there's a reason why he's called Chicken Caesar. And he knows his story very well. <laughs> That's me. When I came here, when I came here a year or I think it was May 2015 when I came here, I was nervous. But when I leave today, I leave here very proud of who and what you guys have meant to our lives. I've learned a whole lot, and the FNB team over here, in my opinion, is the best in the entire Starwood by far. The kitchen staff, the server staff, and you all. And thank you. And I hope to see you all soon. I will be back soon again. You guys are scared for my wife and I. I have the baby Liam too, so thank you. I will miss each and every one of you. But I'm not far, I'll always be here. So thank you. Thanks for the, me Thanks for the memories. I love you all. <laughs> I got them. Uh, I got the last words for uh, Mr. Raul. Uh, he, to he told me as a chicken sister because I forgot a chicken, so that's the name. And I really want to uh, say thanks for this guy um, because um, he was more like my brother. It, uh, my mom passed away like a few months ago and uh, he was next to me. And uh, thanks.